When I look back on my experience making Deadpool and Wolverine, there's a mix of pride and a bit of sorrow that comes to mind. One particular memory stands out, both for the joy it brought and the difficult decision that followed. You see, Rob McElhenney, my friend and co-owner of our beloved Wrexham Football Club, had flown all the way to London to film a cameo for the movie. Rob, ever the good sport, down the gear of a Time Variance Authority soldier, and for a moment, everything felt like it was falling into place. But, as the editing process began, reality set in, as it often does in this industry. The scene, which had seemed like such a perfect addition in theory, just wasn't clicking the way we had hoped. I wanted to hold on to it, and if I'm being honest, I did for much longer than I probably should have, purely because it was Rob, even under the mask and helmet, Rob's talent shone through. His presence brought a certain swagger, a confidence that I've come to admire deeply it's the same quality that has helped him create hit TV shows and that passion he brings to Wrexham. But there's a saying in filmmaking, sometimes you have to kill your darlings. And with a heavy heart, and after much deliberation, I had to cut Rob's cameo. It wasn't easy. I was mortified, really, because he had made such an effort, traveling across an ocean, only to see his work not make it into the final cut. That's the part of the job that never gets easier. In moments like that, when the stress of expectations weighs heavily on you, having friends around makes all the difference. The pressures were immense, not just because of the legacy of Deadpool, but because of everything the film represented. Expectations are a villain unto themselves, and they loomed large over every decision I made. Yet, in the midst of all that stress, there was Rob, grounding me with his presence. When he's around, I find myself calming down, my heart rate slowing, the noise in my head quieting just a bit. Even though his scene didn't make it to the screen, I'm forever grateful that he was there with me on set. Rob shows up for people, and that day, he showed up for me. That's something I'll always cherish, even if it didn't play out the way we both imagined. The film went on to become a success, filled with surprising cameos from other stars that helped drive it to historic box office numbers. But in the end, it's not just the success that I remember. It's the friends who were there along the way, who believed in the project, and who made even the hardest decisions a little more bearable. Rob's cameo may not have made it to the screen, but the memory of that experience, of having him there with me, is something that will stay with me long after the credits roll.